Good morning and welcome back to my channel. I am actually about to head out, hence why I'm all wrapped up in a scarf. It's minus one today, but it is the 1st of December. And so I'm gonna have quite a Christmassy day, I hope. I am putting up my Christmas decorations today. I've done, I've got five advent calendars this year. Um, and I've done, I look like an egg. But I've done two of them already today. And I thought, I look like I'm choking, don't I? But I thought I would just open my bird and blend one because I ate my chocolate once this morning because I couldn't, I, I didn't even think about filming it. Um, which I feel like is a good thing, like waking up excited for eating chocolate in the morning. Who'd have thought? I realised I've really jumped into this quickly, haven't I? I haven't filmed for like two weeks and I don't really have that much to update you on because there's exciting things happening but I can't talk about them. So I do actually feel a bit like I'm choking actually now. Okay, there we go. I've got to get the bus in like eight minutes so I'll be quick but Bird and Blend Tea sent me this advent calendar and I had one last year and it was very exciting. Oh, they've changed the way they've done it. It's actually like a pop door. Ooh, starting off strong. Oh, you get two tea bags, strawberry lemonade. That smells so good. I always love Bird and Blend because the tea bags are so pretty. This is not sponsored, but I do have a discount. No, it's, I don't know if it's a discount code. I have a code and it gets you my favorite tea, I think, for free um, when you order from them. So I will put that on the screen, but that's not like an ad or anything. I am gonna run, I need to get the bus by myself, all the way into town. It's like my biggest exposure therapy thing yet. I did it yesterday with my peer support worker and I'm doing it again today to meet my friend. I'm making huge progress at the minute and I'm feeling very proud of myself. So, let's go. Bus stop. It's minus one and I'm so cold and I look like an egg. I literally forgot to film for like most of the time I was in town but I just got the bus back. I actually got the bus back with my friend. I was planning on getting it alone, but it turned out she, didn't, she needed to get the same bus. So we got the same bus together. But yeah, I got some really nice stuff. I'll give you a haul when I get in. And I had lunch, which I completely forgot to film. Um, but I'll put a picture of what I had on the screen because it was like really nice. I had um, like um, brie and cranberry for catcher thing and a hot chocolate and it was so nice. It was like exactly what I fancied, so. I'm actually quite out of breath. <laughs> I literally just got home, but I thought I would give you a little haul of what I got. The first thing I got, B is going to be very excited about. My favourite animals are Highland cows, and she doesn't have a Highland cow toy. Mum, look. Oh, that's good. And he has a squeaker. She's going to love it. She knows it's for her already, look. Let me take his tag out. The other end of the plastic bits, but can't get to it. Hey, you're excited. It's for you. There you go. He's for you. He's for you. Yay. <laughs> okay, let me get the TK Maxx bag. I didn't get loads of stuff, but I didn't intend on getting anything. So I thought I'd give you all. Um, the first thing I bought is from TK Maxx. It's a big, long, hot water bottle because my nana is coming down for christmas and she loves a hot water bottle and i think you're going to change them every couple years and i don't think many people do and it worries me that she might be using an old one so i bought her a new one and then oh, this is very not in order what else did i get from tk maxx oh i got the toy for b okay that was from tk maxx i know i've got two things um in Superdrug, i got this nyx fat what's it called fat lip drip oil I've seen these like all over TikTok and I was thinking like, mm, I don't really wanna buy one, but then I saw it in the shop and I thought that looks actually gorgeous. I just don't like being influenced by TikTok. Like if I see it in a TikTok ad, I'm like, I don't wanna buy it. I don't know why. It's just like a bit of bit of me that just like flies back. <laughs> I think cause I've tried some TikTok makeup and it's been really shit. Um, so, oh yeah. And this I got from Primark. <laughs> it's a candle in the shape of a car. Like a Christmas car and Brandon and I's Christmas bedding has like literally these little cars on it. It's from TK Maxx so it's not the same but I just thought it was the cutest thing ever. 
like, ah, uh, it's like really nice quality. Um, and it's vanilla, cinnamon, and clove scented. And it's really nice. It's just like got some scene cute. I don't know why I'm doing ASMR on it. This is cute. What else did I get? Oh, I got some underwear from Friday, but I'm not going to show, obviously. And then I wanted some ribbon and like decorations for my Christmas presents. So I got this like gold and green one and then this pink, pinky silver one because some of my wrapping paper has pink in it. So I thought they'd be cute. They have little bows and some ribbons in and some maybe gift tags. I don't know what they are. Oh yeah, gift tags. So I thought they were quite cute. Primark has really good Christmas stuff. Really nice Christmas stuff. And you can get matching pajamas for your dog and you and your child, which I thought was funny. Um, no, in Primark. And then I got this moisturizer because Differin has been drying my skin out and I need like a night cream. So I got the Cetaphil Rich Night Cream. And that's my haul. Yay, and I had a really nice lunch and I had a really nice time and I got the bus by myself. Ooh. Um, and I am wearing this scarf around the house because I won't lie, I'm cold. All my scrunchies falling off my head. But yeah, I'm quite proud of myself, really. We're gonna have a cuppa. <gasps> Ooh, I haven't done my spice advent calendar. Mom, it's time. This is an advent calendar that was gifted to me by Just Spices. And I do have a discount code for their website, so I will put that up here. Again, not sponsored, um, but if I can get you discounts, I'll get you discounts. It's giant. I don't think I've ever had a bigger advent calendar ever in my life. And I need to find the number one door. Am I blind? <laughs> oh wait, it's there. I found it. Oh wow, it's like a full on, ooh, pizza topping. That'll be great because we make um, pizza toast quite a lot for lunch. Mm. So that'll be good. Spice up your pizza, bruschetta or focaccia in no time with this Mediterranean style mix. Day one was a pizza topping. That's very exciting. I'm feeling so Christmassy. Um, I have a bit of work that I need to do on my laptop and then I'm gonna decorate the house. I'm excited. It's advent calendar time. Look up here. Yes, good girl. So clever, well done. All by yourself. What well, advent calendar, is it the button up box one? Yeah. yeah. Looks like bits of bark. Is that yummy? Touch. You've got to do minimal work to get them. Kiss. Thank you. No. <laughs> oh. You're so beautiful. You know what time it is. It's Christmas decorating time. What sort of size are you? Um, I'm having a wee break from decorating to finish off the prep cookie that I bought yesterday. I ate like half of it yesterday. It's probably gone a bit hard and dry now, but oh well. Mm. This is a reminder. I know around Christmas there's a lot of like pressure on food and there's a lot of food around in general. I just want to remind you that absolutely no one is judging you for joining in or eating. I personally think food is one of the best things at Christmas time, like all the special foods and like dinner and everything. This is just a reminder that you should take this opportunity to join in. Mm. Oh, my camera's dying, as per usual. I'm going to finish the tree off, probably vlog on my phone, and see you in a bit. in a devastating turn of events. Um, the angel <laughs> fell off the top of the tree and um, her head fell off. 
She's been, you know, she's she lost her arm quite quite a number of years ago, but I just feel like beheading an angel is some sort of Oh no, mum's home. And I've gotta to confess to my crimes. Mum! <laughs> the angel fell off the tree and lost her head, but it can be glued back on. It's a clean break. Yeah, just a bit sad. I tried to move the tree and then she just went. I don't like it. Oh, I thought you were looking at my beautiful Christmas tree and saying you don't like it. No, I was saying the angel thought I don't like it. Okay, so me and my dad, I don't know if I said this earlier, me and my dad are about to go to the cinema to watch the new Hunger Games film. Um, I, fun fact about me, that was actually really embarrassing, but I used to run a Hunger Games fan account when I was a kid. I was literally obsessed with it, like Hunger Games, Fault in Our Stars, Divergent, all of that like was my life. I was obsessed. And so yeah, me and my dad are going to watch the new Hunger Games film and I'm so excited. It's got really good reviews. I was a bit ill earlier in the week. I say this in every video, right? There's got to be something wrong with me because I get ill so much. But to be fair, recently it's been like actual genuine random stuff. Like I had a cold and then I had a sickness bug and then this week it was that um, one of my medications increased and it gave me a migraine and made me feel sick. I think it's just like a perfect storm of loads of things. But anyway, I was gonna say, this um, f fat oil <laughs> um, is actually really nice. I put it on my lips and it feels like it's not sticky and I like that and it's kind of hydrating. I'm also vlogging on my phone right now because my camera's died. Our room's a bit of a mess and I just, I feel like vlogging on my phone is fine. I got a new iPhone purely, well, both for storage reasons and for camera quality. So like, why not use it to vlog, you know? Excited to go to the cinema and see the Hunger Games. I actually don't even know if this is gonna like be on me because I'm still filming on my phone. Um, but we just watched the Hunger Games, the ballad of songbirds and snakes. Um, and it was, <laughs> it was so good. It was really, really good. Um, it exceeded my expectations because I didn't really know what to expect. Um, and I just had a really lovely festive day. Apart from decapitating the angel, um, everything's been wonderful. And I'm feeling very excited for December. I'm so excited for Christmas. and so excited for the new year because there's lots of exciting things happening. I'm going to have a snack now and a cup of herbal tea, not caffeinated tea because I would be awake all night. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching. I hopefully will post a video next week. Um, I love you all lots and take care.